Why would Dave Chappell bring Elon Musk on stage? He bought me a jetpack I believe were Dave's words. So we will all talk about it on Monday. To be controversial. Rich people gonna rich. He's obviously supportive of him. Honestly, I think Chapel is starting to fall into that area of humor where he just likes doing stuff that he knows annoys people rather than trying to actually be funny. Because people keep giving it attention. Jesus Christ how hard is it for everyone to just delete Twitter and ignore this dude. Elon's got a tight five that he's ready to share with all of us. Get ready to laugh. Class Solidarity it was a part of a deal made between them earlier where David would legally own the first comedy club on Mars. Attention is currency. Ye all emerald clown is the biggest attention whore out there right now. He very clearly said, he bought me a jetpack so boo these nuts. Same reason why Elon was in Big Bang Theory. People die for a touch with fame or infamous anybody with any type of notoriety is revered like a god in our stupid culture. Would we be talking about his show if he hadn't? Rich assholes tend to flock together. Money bag money with wings banknote with dollar sign euro money mouth face money bag money with wings banknote with dollar sign euro money mouth face. They are in this ridiculous club that thinks they are saving the world from the woke mob and defending free speech. What they really are is just a bunch of rich fucks who think they have all the answers but really it's just that their wealth affords them a bigger platform to toss their ideas from. Because Elon Musk is a joke. Desperate for attention. Bad press is good press for the likes of these types. Dick ain't gonna suck itself. Cringe loves cringe. Dave Chappell has been a conservative the entire time. People forget because he made fun of racists. But if you followed his jokes even back then, he was anti-abortion made relentless fun of vilifying the homeless, and wasn't particularly kind to gay people or women in his comedy either. Because if people focused on the quality of his jokes they'd notice that modern Dave is a sad sack of shit compared to Chappell show Dave. The richest man on earth can afford to buy the most expensive I have a black friend card in the world. Edit a word. It's a big club, and you ain't in it. George Carlin. Because he has no new material. Look at everything he has done. It's all the same shtick. At this point he's a hack at best. He's a rich freak who has had his brain liquefied by his millions. He probably supports Elon but lately Dave talks like he's at a TED talk trying to be more of a public speaker while using comedy to get a crowd. Most of the topics he brings up are cultural and political issues rather than comedy. I enjoyed his first couple of specials for his return but now he's just beating a dead horse. Pretty sure Dave has realized he gets put more on the spotlight when he talks about this type of thing. The audience he's gathered keeps reinforcing him to keep it going. The real answer is because the rich stick out for each other. Elon's getting rough PR so coming out on stage with a comedian liked by his people was supposed to help with that. All this hate and misunderstanding for someone with a mental disorder who doesn't conform to their normalcy. Unbelievable. If you've got nothing nice to say why not shut your trap. Ego plus dollar 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 dollar. Because Dave Chappell is basically Kanye with more self-control. I'm not saying the guy likes Nazis, but he definitely likes the Republican Party. He's just smart enough to be cool about it. The Dave you remember isn't rich Dave Chappell. This version of Dave Chappell would hang out with Elon, whereas Pete Chappell would have made fun of him for an hour. This version of Chappell makes fun of the regular people who paid to see him. I would have the audience vote to let him stay or leave. Chapel loves controversy. Elon loves attention. Wouldn't surprise me if Musk paid Chapel for the privilege. I would be booing too if I paid to see Chapel do a comedy show and had to listen to a rich entitled racist narcissist asshole get on stage so he could stroke his already gargantuan ego. 
because Dave feeds off controversy. It keeps people talking about him. Why wouldn't Dave Chappell bring Elon Musk on stage? That's the real question right there. Why does a dog lick his balls? Because he can winking face. Cause he's a rich idiot jerking off a richer idiot. I thought Chappell was at least anti-racist, so it's weird to me that he wanted the guy whose wealth stems from apartheid dual minds up on stage. Guess he hates trans people more. Publicity stunt. Why not? Because he likes him. Why wouldn't he? I believe it started after Musk went on SNL. He actually did pretty well and he joked on Twitter afterwards that he was going to become an entertainer. That led to Chappell responding that he could do stand-up at his shows. For whatever reason, Musk just didn't perform. The problem is, that you'll care this much. Live your lives, this shit does not matter one bit. Here's a fun fact that makes people uncomfortable a lot of us don't hate Musk like the rest of Reddit does. They are both old out of touch weirdos who think they are the only ones that say what they think. Cause he's done more for society than all of Reddit combined. Lib's mad he actually eradicated the psycho leftist muck that suppressed truthful inconvenient political speech. Because outside of the Reddit hive mind there's people with diverse opinions. I'm starting to think he may be out of touch and or into the whole getting off on upsetting people thing. Because they are both self-aggrandizing assholes. So that he could lecture the crowd for booing him. To feed the anger and misguided vitriol from Redditors. The rest of humanity literally does not give a damn about Elon being on stage with Dave Chappell for less than five minutes. I was there. Dave was trying to make a point about keeping freedom of speech alive and accepting opposite viewpoints. He brought Elon on to maybe try to reiterate Elon's commitment to freedom of speech. Dave was unhappy about the audience booing someone who he perceived as trying keep speech free with Twitter. Suddenly we are all on the Elon hate train again? What happened? I thought this was an Askuji lol. They have the same beliefs. Rich people are out of touch. Because they are both out of touch celebrities that truly believe they are everyone's hero, when actually they are total shitbags. I miss George Carlin. He was vile and vulgar and was never afraid to say fuck the man. But, he never took swings at the little guy, never kicked anyone who was already down. I've loved Chapel most of my early life, but celebrities these days could stand to learn a thing or two from the people who were truly great. And fuck the man. Dave's lost touch. He used to be a Joe Everyman which is what got him famous. Now he's one of the bullshit elites that he would have hated when he was getting his start. I still think he's funny. But I would avoid him if he was in the same room as me. When Trump was elected, Chappell went on SNL and asked America to give Trump a chance. That's when respect was lost, and it went downhill from there. Same reason that Kanye says half the things he does they think of themselves as controversial parriers who speak the truth. They can't fathom the idea that some of their opinions are flawed and they see other controversial people as brothers in arms. We need to understand that people like Dave hate cancel culture. He wants the right to say shitty things without punishment. Elon is the current embodiment. Edgelord's Gunner Edge Rich man with no charisma or credibility ask rich man with charisma and some credibility if he can borrow some of his. Says a lot that it ended up being Dave Chappell answering the call since he burned up most of his credibility at the Battle of Hey why can't I publicly mock and shame trans folks cause they make me uncomfortable Hill. Because he lost the perspective he had when he was an up struggling comic. He's the establishment. He's the power and wants to impress other power. X200B. Edit also surprising that Dave Chappell likes someone whose dad made money from an emerald mine in apartheid South Africa.